Hello everyone, Thrones 3 here from KTFO Gaming, and I don't even know why I'm saying this because this isn't even the first part, but it's the first part for today. So you know when, when uh, I'm starting a new day, because I don't always say that. I'm really gonna stop that. Alright, um, God, what I was exactly at? Oh, uh, where do I need to be first of all? Oh, it's close. Okay. I probably would have completed this yesterday, but I fell asleep because I'm a lazy shit. <laughs> and, uh, no, actually, what happened was I think I probably already told you, I'll say it in a later video, but, uh, what was it? What was I gonna say? I'm coming for you. We must hold this position for as long as it takes. If that. the enemy is allowed to push through. Connor, my friend. You have arrived just in time to bear witness to our glorious victory. Where is Charles Lee? That batar. He shows up in the middle of our preparations and just takes charge. Screams at everyone to advance, and then runs. I am left to pick up the pieces. Where did they come from? Get word that we are falling back! Everyone, to me! Now! Now! I will hold the area while you bring them to safety. Charles, we fuck them. I grant you my finest soldiers to serve as your personal guard. There is nothing they will not do to ensure you are victorious. Bon chance, mon ami. Big chunk of shit. We'll push these red coats back here. That's a bad idea. We need to get these guys on the way to the right. Very 
seconds. Did it. We are low on ammunition, sir, and the enemy advances. Then we need to pull back, rejoin the others, and cover their escape. Uh. Sick of this shit. Fucking stupid red coats. Bitch. Come on, Connor. We're, we're, we're wasting time here. How did them red coats get there anyway? They go through this. Yeah. I'm coming for them. I definitely press circle. Oh fuck this, I don't even need to do this. I'll stop this execution over here until we get. We need to go now quickly! Do not worry about the red coat. Go join the others. Alright, I'm done. He's in my sight. Hopefully I get full sync. The red coat's gonna want it a day. See how many people in there? I'm gonna drink a drink. Shit. Well done, my friend. You have saved many lives today. Connor? Charles Lee has betrayed you. He forced retreat in the midst of battle, hoping the loss would take the lives of your men and see you relieved of your command. What? I'm sure he will come and spin a tale saying that he was outnumbered or. I was somehow to blame. All lies. I will say it one last time. That man is your enemy, and he will not stop until you are dead or dishonored. Connor's tale rings true. Lee was acting most odd upon the battlefield. I will investigate these allegations at once. <laughs> the time for that is long past. This must be done properly. Else we're no better than those we oppose. Never mind the political ramifications of such an act. Should you choose to spare Lee's life, then I will take it myself. Enjoy your victory, Commander. It will be the last I deliver you. Connor fucking hates him. He fucking despises him. Everything he does just pisses Connor's off. A grim, grim expectations. It's a trophy I just got. I don't know if it's a trophy for this memory sync. Not even not for the memory sync for this like whole sequence. Yep. On a sequence eleven. We're almost done. Something's happened, Desmond. Abstergo has your dad. God damn it! Where? Italy. Same place they were holding you. What are you two waiting for? Let's go! There's more. Hello again, Mr. Miles. I hope this message finds you well, or as well as it can, all things considered. It appears we now each have something the other desires. I propose a trade. Bring me the apple, and I'll return your father to you no worse for the wear. 
Should you refuse, he will still be returned, albeit much worse for the wear. I assume you'd like to avoid an unpleasant outcome. Or prick. <laughs> 